Hey guys, it's Harry the Red Bagnall Engine here and welcome back to another review video and today we are going to be doing a review on the Polar Express. Yep, that is what we are going to be reviewing today. Now, just before I get into this review video, I would just like to say to any of you who don't like this movie, I respect your opinion but as long as you respect mine in return. But without further ado, let's get right into it, shall we? So, the Polar Express. Oh man, I so love this Christmas movie. Why do I like this movie so much? Well, I'm going to run through the reasons why I like this movie. One reason why I like the Polar Express so much is one thing, yes, I know it's going to sound obvious, but... One reason why I like this movie is simply because it's about a train. And obviously a lot of you can probably tell that I really like trains. Train spotting or going on trains is a hobby I have. And that is one reason why I like the Polar Express. Another reason why I like the Polar Express so much is actually with what a magical movie it is. Because at the start of the movie, we get the character of the, the main character of the movie, the hero boy, who is having disbeliefs on whether santa is real but as he's just about to settle down a magic train just randomly appears at his house and to be fair i think if i was that kid i'd be very confused on what would be happening and after the boy goes outside he the conductor tells him where the train is going and at first the boy has decides not to get on but then as the polar express starts leaving he decides to get on and they head off to the North Pole. But anyway, enough on the history lesson. Another thing that I really like about this movie as well is actually the animation. I know a lot of people actually say that the animation is a little creepy. And, you know, fair enough. But in my opinion, for 2004 standards, the animation in this is pretty good. And to be honest, it's not even aged that well either. Also, a little plot, a little off topic once again, guys, but did you know that the conductor in the Polar Express is actually voiced by Tom Hanks? Yes, Tom Hanks, the same guy who also voices Woody in the Toy Story franchise. Also, but anyway, back on topic. While I while but while I have a lot of positives to say about this movie, there are actually one or two things that I don't like or just make me feel a bit meh which i'm gonna go over right now one thing that i actually don't like about the polar express is actually a scene where um the conductor takes the hero girl on the roof of the train like i know that if you don't have a ticket you can't go on the train but come on mr Con come on conductor you should have known that that was very very dangerous and Another thing as well that I feel didn't make much sense or I didn't like is the fact that a 10-year-old girl was trusted in driving a big steam engine. Like, how does that make any sense? Another thing as well that I don't really like about the movie, and I know I was actually praising this earlier, but sometimes the animation is a bit creepy. Yes, I know. I know I was praising the animation a few minutes ago, but I do have to admit, there are times where the animation on the human characters is, yeah, kind of creepy. But that is just my opinion, and you guys are welcome to disagree with me. But apart from those two nitpicks, I really, really enjoy The Polar Express, and it is definitely one of my favourite movies to watch around Christmas time. And if you guys haven't seen it, then I highly recommend it to you. Alright then guys, that brings us to the end of another review video. Like I always say, apologies if this one is a little short, it's just, while I, while I really enjoy the Polar Express, there wasn't really that much that I needed to say about it, but never mind. But anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video, then don't forget to hit that like button down below, and if you are new to the channel, then hit that subscribe button down below, and turn on the notification bell where you will receive all notifications. But for now, this is Harry, the Red Bagnall Engine, 
signing off. Peace out everyone, peace out and Merry Christmas to you all.